Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. Hey there everyone, this is Ryan Pearson, aka The Frugal Geek, with another Windows 8 tip. If you want to install a networked printer to your Windows 8 PC, the process of doing so is actually quite straightforward. First thing you'll need to do is access the control panel. Now you can do this through a hotkey combination, or if you're lazy like myself, you can simply go to the desktop, move your mouse to the lower left corner, and right click. And that will bring up a list of administrative features that you can take advantage of. For example, control panel. Just give that a left click. Bam! That brings up the control panel. It's ready for you. In order to install a printer, you'll need to go to the device and printers menu. And this is accessible right here under hardware and sound. Just click view devices and printers. And you'll be met with a list of devices that have been attached to your PC in one way or another. Some of them are software based. Some of them are hardware. In this case, we see two printers here. Neither one of them are actually physical printers. But there is a printer on my network I would like to install. In order to install it, I just need to hit Add a Printer in the upper left area of the screen. I'll hit that. And you see right here it found a printer on my network. It has a local IP, which means that it is in fact attached to my network and not somewhere out in the abyss waiting to be connected. Okay, so it's an ML2525W series from Samsung. That's how it's identifying itself, and this is important later on. I'll show you why. Just go ahead and give that a left click so that it is highlighted, and right down here you'll want to hit the Next button. At this point, it did not detect a driver. Sometimes it will, but sometimes it won't. You'll need to either pick your driver through this list here, or you'll want to hit Windows Update. Windows Update will solve the problem for you most of the time. It'll automatically detect the driver and download it. Sometimes it won't, and you'll need to insert a disk from the manufacturer. This is usually included in the box with the printer. If you don't have the disk, you can download the drivers from the manufacturer and install them before going through this whole rigmarole. For me, I believe my Samsung printer is listed in the default list it is an ML 2525W and there it is I have clicked that with the left click and I'm gonna hit next okay it's gonna say you already have a driver installed this does not come up for everyone sometimes you don't have the driver installed already I do so I'm gonna take the recommended course of action and just hit next otherwise you can say replace the current driver and it will replace your driver with the driver found in Windows Update all right, I'm going to hit next, and now I can name the printer. I'm going to name this printer my printer, just because. And <laughs> this will come up whenever it says, which printer would you like to print with? You'll say my printer. Okay, I'm going to hit next, and it will ask, do you want to share the printer on the network, or do you not want to share the printer? Not sharing the printer does not mean nobody else on the network can attach to the printer. The printer's already on the network being shared, so you don't need to extend the favor by basically creating a duplicate printer on your network. So don't share the printer if it's already networked. You don't need to. Okay, you've successfully added the printer. You can choose to print a test page or hit finish and check to make sure that your printer is set as default. If you want to set it as default, just right click and set as default printer. You'll see this little green check whenever it is your default. That's it. I've installed a printer and I'm ready to go. If you have any questions about Windows 8 processes or policies or what have you, please leave them in the comment section below and we'll get to them as soon as we can. For now, I'm Ryan Pearson and I'm out.